All right, hey, how's it going, guys? It's Jaro, and we're waiting outside the uh, Star Wars: The Old Republic meet and greet, and I'm here with uh, Rebuck from Eternal Vigilance. Cool, cool. And uh, tell us a little bit about your guild, man. Uh, we are a Republic lined guild, uh, but we're focusing more kind of on the gray side. So we take all types of players that uh, don't have to be goody goody two shoes if you want to, and kind of the the story side of things, you can take whatever path you want, and we'll stay, still take you in. Uh, we're actually part of a multi-gaming guild, so we've actually just recently started up uh, another division for Battlefront or uh, Battlefield 3, Battle <laughs> Battlefront. Yeah, we're, we'd love to see that. Uh, but uh, so we kind of we've got people all over the world, down in Australia, and uh, a lot of people in the UK. Um, yeah, we're more focused on uh, East Coast, but we're pretty much everywhere. Cool, cool. Yeah, and and you know, Gen Jedi and. A uh, Eternal Vigilance has a, have a little bit of uh, history together as well. Yeah. Uh, I'm in Gen Jedi and Empire Guild, and you know we do a little bit of RP as well. Um, but uh, you know, what uh, what what are you most excited about to see? What have you gotten your hands on? Have you gotten your hands on the game? Um, there's some people that have been playing it a little bit. Um, gotta love downtown Seattle. <laughs> Um, <clears throat> one of the things I'm really looking forward to is finding out more about the uh, Eternity Vault. I have, it's very limited the information that we've seen on it, kind of little teaser videos and things, and I'm actually, t while we're here, I'm really looking forward to tomorrow because they mentioned that they're hopefully going to draw a couple people out of the crowd up at the, for the uh, event tomorrow evening to get up and actually play the game for a little bit, so, really? you know. Hoping I actually get a chance to do that. That'd be pretty cool. Yeah, that would be awesome. I didn't actually hear that, so that that would be awesome, man. Uh, and tell us a little bit about you. This is your first time at PAX, right? Right, it is. Yeah. So tell us a little bit about your experience here and and, and how it's been this overall. Uh, pretty overwhelming. <laughs> the uh, when we walked in yesterday morning, I just I could not believe how much stuff was crammed into what seemed like a small area. You know, when you got all these tall walls and and banners and you know firefall everywhere and all the bodies and everything else it was you know just really impressive to see how much stuff was here so we're just kind of like running around little heads bobbing around trying to figure out where do i want to go oh oh there's bioware remember where that at okay and you know just kind of wandering around but we kind of you know lined things up a little bit later on in the day and actually got a chance to play tour for a little bit and then uh visit some of the other things that we wanted to Cool, cool. Yeah, you you get your sort of sea legs, your pax legs after after a couple hours, of, you know, of walking walking around the floor. So uh, you're you're waiting in line. We're waiting in line right now to go go to the meet and greet. Are you excited about that? Oh yeah, yeah, definitely. Uh, it's, it's always great to talk to the guys in there, and you know, I mean, I just met you guys here finally, you know, in line, and I've been talking to you guys online for a long time. So it's pretty cool to meet other community people that. Uh, I normally wouldn't ever get a chance to meet in person because this is kind of my only opportunity to be able to get out to an event like this. So it's nice to be able to get back inside and talk to the devs more, the community guys. and So, yeah, it should be a lot of fun tonight. Cool, man. Yeah, it, it, I'm really looking forward to it and seeing the devs in a whole different light. You know, they're they're a little bit more relaxed and it's, it's going to be pretty cool to see them uh, that way. Uh, one last thing, what type of... Uh, you're the community outreach coordinator, right, for Eternal Vigilance? Right. Okay, so what... Uh, what uh, type of projects are you working on to uh, reach out to the community? Uh, well, we've got a few projects that are existing already. Uh, one of the big ones is the Ideal Guild Quiz. Um, I'm actually the one that kind of did the code on that. Uh, working with our, our command staff in our guild, we helped design all of the questions and answers on that. And uh, I did the building on it because I'm a programmer in real life. So kind of right up my alley to do that kind of work. And we've got 130 guilds in it already, and you know we're nearing about 3,800 uh, responses so far, and yeah, you know, getting a lot of good feedback from it. Uh, got a couple other things. We've got a community RSS feed where we take all the different fan sites, wrap them all up into a single feed, and then we've got it posted up in another community thread out on the official forum, so that way people can subscribe to one feed and get information from every fan site that's out there. Um, yeah, you know, there's kind of things like that. I mean, there's there's a few other projects we'll probably, uh, you know, we're 
looking at different things, trying to figure awesome. out what other ideas we can do. And, you know, it's, it's all about contributing back to the community, trying to help everybody else out. And because uh, you can get lost on those forums <laughs> very quickly. Oh, do, do I ever know the general? If you spend five minutes in the general discussion forum, I think your IQ drops by 100. But, um, you know, that sounds really awesome. You, you guys are always coming up with creative stuff. And, you know, it's, it's not hard in a community that's as awesome as Star Wars The Old Republic. And I, I wish you guys good luck. And if you're looking for a really awesome uh, Republic Guild, it doesn't get much better than Eternal Vigilance. So check them out. Uh, wh where can they find you? Uh, EVCitadel.com. Cool. Well, uh, check it out. We're going to head into the uh, Star Wars The Old Republic meet and greet real quick. And, uh, but thank you so much, Reebok, uh, for this interview. And, and we'll, see you, uh, we'll see you in there. All right. Take care. All right, thanks, man. Cool. Thanks.